CG Market Watch. On today's CG Market Watch, in the past 24 hours, we actually lost 42 billion to our market cap. I think everybody is wondering why we lost that amount of money. Could it be because of uh, the market manipulation? Was it because of the current World Cup? Or was it because of Donald Trump and Kim Jong-un? There are many, many things that we can kind of deduce and obviously you, the viewer, wants an answer. So on the, on the immediate news that we want to kind of cover is um, the current market manipulation. So CFTC actually was doing kind of like an investigation on the current Bitcoin price futures because the Bitcoin price futures are being priced by four cryptocurrencies uh, in question, which is Coinbase, Bit, uh, Bitstamp, Itbit, and Kraken. So I think the most important thing is, do we see a certain level of spoofing in the markets? So maybe we will allow Andy to kind of cover what all that means and what it entails to this current market situation. Andy? Right, so the CFTC is actually known as the US Commodity Futures Trading Commission. And because CME is part of the Futures Commission, and therefore they, the CFTC has the jurisdiction over the CME to investigate on the pricing of the four different exchanges, right? Um, and what Ryan mentioned about spoofing, it's basically spoofing is like order books manipulation. Meaning you say I put like I create a buy wall at a particular price. Oh, so everyone yeah, you know, so, so everyone started price above me and therefore pushing the price up. And then I put my major order, I cancel my major order, buy order, and I can sell at a higher price. So that's what spoofing meant. And there's a certain suspicion on that, um, on these four exchanges, mm -hmm. but as of now, um, Coinbase and Bitstem are unwilling to comment anything about the investigation. Yeah, so with regards to the other exchanges, nothing has been heard. And this article is published by CCN on the 9th of June. I think uh, apart from that, we have CoinRail being hacked. Uh, so CoinRail is uh, it's an exchange in South Korea that was recently hacked, I think, for 40, yeah, 40, 40 million. 40 million. Yeah. But still, guys, that's just 40 million out of the 42 billion in terms of market cap that we lost. I mean, do we actually see new money coming into the markets and at the same time, are we anticipating a bear market? That means we are, we're already in a bear market. We're not anticipating, we're already in a bear market. It's the point where, do we see ourselves recovering, especially after this period in June, where markets were actually, last year, we actually had the July FUD, which was China just basically banning anything with regards to uh, exchanges and at the same time, they were really uh, strict and also banned ICOs. Right? But I think in light of uh, all these uh, current circumstances and situations, um, we have China actually gradually probably opening up and even Xi Jinping, uh, which was covered in CG Market Watch in our previous episode where he was very pro, uh, pro blockchain technology and looking very much into the space. So I think for the fact that we have lost this, uh, this kind of market cap, but apparently it's just the same money moving around. Right? It's the same yep. money moving around. I think our portfolios in terms of, uh, from the all coins perspective, it is not doing very, very well. Okay? Um, I think we can say that we lost, any <laughs> we lost anywhere from 7% to as high as 25 to even 30%. Right? And I think that is quite scary in terms of uh, one, day one to two day volatility. So I think the only cryptocurrency that is still up is Veritasium. Mike, do you have more coverage on Veritasium? <coughs> okay, it's led by uh, Reggie Middleton. Oh, close enough. Mm. Uh, it has no white paper. It has no roadmap. Uh, if you Google it, they'll ask, like, is it a scam? And a few people think that it is like decentralized, the coin decentralized. It's like, oh, it's a scam. And like, uh, don't know what it is. The website is overly complicated. And but what does it do? It's a gateway for peer-to-peer -peer transactions. It's a gateway for okay. peer-to-peer -peer transactions. According to their website, because I can't check their website. Wow, so much is it up today? 7%? Seven, 7%? Seven seven percent. Percent. Yeah. Which and is not too bad yeah, for the fact that everything else went down. Yeah. And their videos are pretty good. They have like yachts, they have like gold bars, they have like Dubai, and all we have is like these stupid chairs. Maybe you should bring some gold here so you yeah. can get more views. Mm -hmm. <coughs> so, what do you think caused the whole market cap to drop? If you have any other news about why this, this market cap actually pulled back or why we are facing this pullback, feel free to comment below and we'll see you, uh, see you in the next CG Market Watch.